everybody and despite the way that I'm dressed it is actually 2 50 in the morning and I'm about to move across the country today I've got my leather jacket on because I'm afraid it's gonna crease and I got my scad sweatshirt I thought it was only fitting and a million suitcases my mom and I stayed the night at my grandma's house because we needed to leave the dog with her for dog sitting so we packed up the house and everything I spent time with my cats and just said goodbye to my room I left my cat pillar in charge to watch over it. I'm about to get into an Uber or a Lyft, sorry. Bye. I'm gonna miss you. I'm gonna miss you too, my darling. We did it. We made it through security and we checked my bags. I'm on the electric slide. I need to fill up my Glossier water bottle. I ended up getting this for Easter. It was tempting at the Glossier store when we went in Seattle. Our first stop today is Denver. I have been to that airport years ago, so I'm thrilled to go back. <laughs> I made it on the plane. My mom is sitting in a different spot, so I'll be by the window all alone. For this first flight, I think I'm just gonna sleep. Let's go to Colorado. Welcome to Colorado. We have Dunkin' Donuts, which we do not have in Oregon. Now it is time for plane two to Savannah. We made it to Savannah. Look at this airport, it's crazy. They have the Leopold ice cream that's supposed to be famous here. Cool. And now we have to go collect our one million thousand billion bags. We have all four of our checked bags. I feel like I'm in a locker room. They were not lying about the humidity and I'm sitting in a rocking chair because they have these at the airport. Very southern. I feel like my grandma right now. I slept so much on the plane, but I'm going to definitely take a nap. Hello from the hotel. I am very tired, but we are going out in the humidity. We're braving it because we need to eat. We're just gonna find something walking distance and whatever sounds good will pop in. We might get peach cobbler, but someone's complaining because it's a seven minute walk. And it feels like a bathtub outside. We are walking around downtown Savannah now. We're still trying to find a place to eat, but it's very cute so far, which is very so exciting. Cute. We ended up settling on this Asian restaurant and I got a vegetable stir fry and rice and mom got tofu with rice as well. Look at this adorable pretty fortune cookie. You will find your solution where you least expect it. Mine says you have an ambitious nature and you'll make a name for yourself which I love and I'm gonna keep this. Hey Patty, bought you some cookies. <laughs> we have made it to the peach cobbler factory. I wanted to come here so bad. This is my cobbler and I need to assemble it with the vanilla ice cream that it came with. No way I'm going to be able to finish all of this. So good. Oh, that's great. It's so nice and warm. Try mine. I'm not a pudding person. But it's banana. You can edit it. Wow. Banana cream pie, basically. I clearly chose the best. Six hours later. Hi, it's much later now. We came back to the hotel and went to bed. And then I woke up thinking it was like 4 in the morning. And it was only 11.30. And then like 20 minutes after I woke up, my mom woke up and was like, gee, I'm ready for a breakfast. So it's like 1 in the morning. My mom and I are hungry. So we're going to go get something to eat. And we've just spent like the last hour and a half. Calling family. Oh, and because three hours ahead, it's past midnight, Savannah, so it's my 19th birthday. I'm so tired. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We found food. We gotta try this at some point. Pizzeria? <laughs> I need something. I might get this. I'll have a plant. We got a bunch of munchy type situations and my mom got a Coke. So we're having a really nutritious meal at one in the morning. The woman working the counter was so nice. She was like, oh my God, yeah, um, 
It's not anywhere close to breakfast. Today is Thursday. Thursday ice cream. It's my birthday. It's my birthday. And the hotel room is a mess, but still my birthday. Finally get to wear this Hello Kitty shirt that I found at Goodwill because it's my birthday. I also have these little fun clips and I'm wearing these pink pants that got really wrinkled in the suitcase and I had to use the iron. What, about what I'm wearing? This is what she is wearing for the birthday agenda today. We are doing some exploring of Savannah some more and we have reservations at this restaurant, Better Than Sex, all dessert. I'm so excited. We want to go to the cat cafe but all the reservations are full so I might do that with my roommates later. Oh my god, the lens is fogging from humidity. It is so freaking humid. What am I going to do oh, it's already fogging up again you this is crazy i've never had to deal with this you're just gonna have to be a little foggy hope you understand we're gonna do some shopping today as well to celebrate my birthday and celebrate me hi i love your hair it's so beautiful i'm in urban outfitters now we saw the cutest little dog at that soap store and i got a scrub and we went into this local shop and we had a really positive interaction with the woman working we found this frilly pink tank top but i got it in a medium because i was worried about like the cup section so i'm gonna try it on we're still looking around it's giving taylor swift jumpsuit we're back at the hotel i'm gonna get ready again i straightened my hair this morning and look at miss humidity it's also raining now our reservation is soon so i'm gonna put on a sparkly dress actually the dress that i wore in my very first youtube video of this year and i said in that video i hope that I have an opportunity to wear it somewhere uh, in 2022. And today is the day. I think it's only fitting. Green heart emoji is the vibe of today. So even though I love my birthday outfit, let's change. And I'm done. Obviously this shimmery green dress. I have this black leather, leather, it's pleather coat. I have red lipstick on now and a nice sparkly jewelry and we have to go walk to a reservation it's in like 10 minutes and then we have the ghost tour this evening that's what we are most excited about no there it is better than sex here we come oh my god so we're in it's very dark in here server is hilarious he's like do you mind if i talk dirty to all of you and like everything is sexual like if i said some of the stuff on the menu this video would get taken down i don't even know what, how to say it there's a rim around my glass i think you can connect it so i'm having one of those I need to figure out what I'm getting for like dessert. There's no food, it's just alcohol and dessert. Obviously I'm not drinking, mom is. I'll see you when all of this stuff gets here. Food cake, and I love my 19th birthday candle. Woo! And now I can try all I got the cookie nookie pie, it looks amazing. And I got the Italian stallion. And a tingle, peach tingle? I wanna try this, I wanna try this. And that's a chocolate really Say that. Mm. Definitely cream in the cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> so this is like a caramel chocolate chip cookie type of thing. Mm. Mm. There's nuts. Mm. Mm. Oh my gosh. Ten I've never ten. been spoken to so dirty in my life. <laughs> Our server, shout out to Nicholas. If you're watching this, you were fantastic. We're going to this this ghost tour where I'm literally gonna get possessed. Hopefully. We are meeting up in this park. We're getting picked up in a hearse. Everything is so freaking old. I love it. Bird Girl lives here. Yeah, right? I keep seeing this. Little Wendy, more commonly known as Bird Girl, 1936 bronze sculpture that once stood in Bonaventure Cemetery. She became famous when she appeared on the 1994 cover of the book Midnight in the Garden of Good and Evil, but the cemetery depicted in the book was actually across the river. The statue now stands on display at Jepson Center. We are waiting outside of this museum for the hearse to come and get us. In all of my 19 years of living, this is my first time going in a hearse. It actually probably won't be my last. Oh, honey. No way. So, you know what's underneath us? Dead people. So many freaking dead people. So many terrible dead Parents, parents pushing their kids out of windows, terrible like executions, crazy ghost tour. But the most beautiful mansions you've ever seen. That was really nice. It didn't oh really, I'll God. be honest, it didn't really feel like a ghost tour. It felt more like a historic tour. Yeah. I actually had a great time, but we're getting pizza now. Here's the pizza. <laughs> Wait, don't fall. Today is Friday. Friday, hot dog. Good 
morning, good morning. good morning. It's move-in day today. I'm walking to my dorm, never been before. My check-in is at 10 and it's 9.50. Pretty short walk from the hotel, but it's the big day. We made it, oh no, my hair is getting humid because it was raining. We made it to my dorm. I'm the first one here. I don't have any of my stuff besides that duffel bag, so we're gonna need to get that. Dorm tour, this is it. That's literally it. But my dad is flying in, because of course, work conflicted with my college move-in, but he's flying in to help us. And my mom and him are like gonna spend some time together in the city and everything. I'm here now, my living quarters. I get to wait for my other roommates to come. made it to Georgia, the Southern Belle himself. He helped me put my cloud on the wall. My bed has the photo organizer, and now we're about to leave and go get other stuff for the room. And he built this cart. My nail polish exploded, but that's okay. This is not their final location, but this is Georgia's version of Tiny Corner. They look so freaking good. I accidentally ordered two of these flower pillows. So I'm gonna have one on my bed and then I put the other one as a cushion for my chair. But now we are going to town. A few moments later. Oh my God, we went shopping, but it's so busy. We can't go anywhere. I'm balancing, ah, balancing my art supplies on my head. We're walking to the school and my mom took her shoe off and because it broke. I'm done, I'm done. No, I can't, I can't with him. How are you feeling? What? much later the rain and wind really got me but they're playing John Mayer in Target I'm in Target but they're like sold out of everything that you could possibly ever want and need wish me luck because I want a boyfriend pillow and they don't even have it every single one of them is black every single one so Amazon today is Saturday Saturday pizza Okay, so it's the next day. I finished up at Target, and this is what my room looks like right now. I don't think I'm gonna buy anything else for the time being. I just need more decor, I need more pillows. This is what my bed looks like now. I think it looks so much better, and oh my god, this blanket, I'm so happy I got it. I need to print out the pictures still. I think this is a good time for you to meet my roommates. <laughs> this is Abby, who's Hi. actually my roommate roommate. Isis is kind of mid, to be honest. <laughs> So that's all I have to share. But we're off to a great start. And then <laughs> there's another room. Nice little braid moment. Scarlet on the floor. Here's Jocelyn, who's currently just <laughs> laughing at Scarlet. We are gonna go to our new student orientation, which is just gonna be fantastic. But we have to go, are we taking the bus? Yeah. yeah. We are in this theater. We just finished the orientation. I thought it was fun. People say it was, okay. it was too much. They handed out these, so now I have a fanny pack, but I'm gonna give it to my mom. Okay, so I just made it back to my dorm. I ended up spending the day with my parents doing some more errands and stuff. It looks like I'm gonna get a bike, which is pretty cool. And I said goodbye to my dad. My mom is still here for an extra day because my dad has to go back to work. So that was pretty sad. And I just have one goodbye left, which is my mom. I think that's gonna be very hard, but I'll get breakfast with her tomorrow. I have no clue where my roommates are because again, I was out. I think they're all getting dinner. But I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching this video. I'm gonna go ahead and end it here because I know I've put a lot of content at you really hope you enjoyed i have no clue what my uploading schedule will look like in the future i will post when i can and i think i'm going to document some really awesome days in college here be sure to like this video if you enjoyed it and dislike it if you did not and please subscribe because next time i post then you'll know wish me all luck sleeping on this very cute bed and i will see you in my next video have a magical day